All right, guys, we're here at the Incline Club, and today we have a race for you. This is something that we came up with just about 20 minutes ago, and I think it's going to be amazing. But it's going to be a relay race, and there's going to be required tricks in this one. It's going to be around the skate park, and then they have to tag the next person in. Speaking of the teams, let's introduce them right now. So the first team we're going to introduce is Team Go Fast, which features Vinny Menino and Mike Feedy. How are you guys feeling today? Fast. 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 Very dude. fast. <laughs> Any other kind of emotions going through? We Very fast in a good way. We Thank came to take this. This is what we do. I love it. In the hair. And Tortoise the next team is going to be Team Love It Affliction. We have Chris All. What's up? And we have the official underscore big boy. Do you guys get it? So Chris All has been coming to my skate park forever, honestly. When was the first time you came here? How old were you think? Um, I think I was 12, 11 or 12. So what are you working on? 11, 12 years now? Yeah. There we go. I'm, I'm good at math. And ever since then, ever since the beginning, he's been more and more evolving into Ben Affleck as he just gets older and older. Chris actually enters amateur Ben Affleck lookalike competitions, and he has yet to win yet, but he's so close that he's working on that day to day. You got it. Come on now. Pretty cool. Let's hear in the comments right now. Doesn't he look like a young Ben Affleck? He really does. He does, yeah, doesn't he? Does. he? Dude, it's them chiseled cheekbones. You know what's a good movie? He's he's the Accountant. He's oh, an accountant. Oh, awesome. yeah. <laughs> Shut up, you financial advisor. <laughs> Have you seen that movie? No. He, he's like, I don't mean to offend you or anything like that. Yeah. No offense. We, we can't anything. really say in the detail of what it's uh, actually yeah, about yeah, in the right. video, but. Why is it bad? First well, kills, like Why am I the only one that hasn't yeah, seen it? And, and, and then he kills people. people. Yeah. Seriously. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. I have no idea yeah, about this. And the third team of the today, we have Team Brookstat featuring Dom Simoncini, Loot Master, and BK All Day. So, what's going on with Brookstat, dude? He's from Brooklyn. I'm from Staten Island. Brookstat works. Simple as that, man. Simple. I like what you did there. Good Thank play you. on words. So let me explain the course for today. You have to start on top of this one right here. So there's going to be two separate runs. The first one has to go down, and they go over the doubles, and then they go up to seven foot, over to the top of the foam pit. You have to next jump into the foam pit. After you jump in the foam pit, you have to take your bike and put it on top of the 10 foot, crawl through the railing, get back on your bike, drop in, go over the street section where the step up is, go up the step up, go up the vert wall over here, and then get back over and high five your teammates so they can go. And then at the end, that's when you're gonna get your time after both teams do it. So now over here is where the tricks come into play. There's a trick list, backflip, 360, tail whip, grind, 720, front flip, all right? All six tricks have to be done within the two runs. Each rider could either do all six of them in one run, or they could split them up three and three if they want. But there's gonna be difficult ones here. There's backflips out there, and not everybody does backflips over here. Now the catch to this is, there's gonna be a jump each into the foam pit by each rider. So when you jump in the foam pit, that would be a time to bring out the front flip or bring out the 720. I wouldn't suggest the grind in the foam pit. I don't think it's gonna work to your favor. So if you guys mess up your own trick, whether it's the back flip, the tail, anything like that, if you slip a foot, that's going to be plus one second on your time, okay? And if you do not even attempt the trick, you have to get plus three seconds, okay? So I suggest you guys try the trick. So we're gonna get this going. Team Go Fast is gonna be the first ones up there. Who's gonna go first? Who you got? I'll take this lead. Right. Vinny's gonna lead the way here. Vinny, man, he's a, he's an ex-pro racer. He's good at what he does. Scott, do you have a lawnmower? I do, currently. You do, yeah. right? Yeah. You know how it's got the, 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 the tortoise mode? Oh, yeah. And then it's got the hair mode? Oh, yeah. Okay, when you mow the lawn in the hair mode, you get, you get all done, but you, then you look back and you miss some spots because you're just going so fast. But when you put it in the tortoise mode, you get attention to detail, okay? They're the hare, the other two teams are tortoises. The tortoise always finishes first. I always thought if you went into turtle mode, that's when you run over the turtle in your yard. <laughs> and if you put the rabbit one on, that's when you go for the rabbit. <laughs> I mean, why wouldn't they just put slow or fast? What's the point of that one? Or why don't they just put Big Boy or Vinny? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, so BK's got the time ready. Team, go fast. Are you guys ready? We are ready. Okay, Vimanino, when I say go, the time officially starts, all right? You have to make contact. You have to high five your teammate for them to be able to go. And he's starting left and forward. He means business. All right, ready, set, go. go, go, go all right, Vimanino, drop it in. What's he going to do? All right, the grind is officially checked off. Going to the double. He's skipping the first one, skipping the second one, going right to work for the phone pit. Drop up in. No problem. Now he's got to get out of the phone pit. This is the hard part, you know? Oh, he got up pretty easy. Maybe it's not that hard. Maybe it's going to be hard for me. I may have fallen up here, so he might be smelling this a little bit. Maybe don't breathe in as much as you think you want to. Drop it in the 10 foot. Now he's going over the step up line. Oh, he's popping up, going up the 
got to do the 720. 720's been pulled. The rotation was completed. He did a full 720. That's two 360s. His bike went back in the phone that he threw that there. That's great. I love your narrative. <laughs> this is awesome. Now, Petey's going to make his way up this big old ledge. He's taking a sweet time, you know. It's no big deal. Oh, he hit me in the nougats. <laughs> That's going to be a real cost to his time. So now I think he's got to do a tail up somewhere as well. One minute, 20, 87. 120.87. That's awesome. Let's go over to the board and check everything off. The backflip was done. Yes. Perfect. 360 done. Tail whip done. Grind was done. 720 was completed. And the front flip was done. All checks. No time added on to it. So they did perfect. 120.87 right there. Perfect. So it's time for round two. I just want to let you guys know, he also threw his bike out of the foam pit. It hit the wall and bounced right back in the foam pit. It's great. We got it all on the <laughs> All right, so here we go. Team Love and Afflection. Ready, set, go. Time to officially start for the big boy. What's his first trick going to be? Ice pick grind. Great work. Going over to the double. He's pumping the first one, pumping the second one. All right, up to the foam pit. Woo. Oh, the roll of the foam flip. Come on, big boy, hustle, hustle. Light is up. Yeah, the army roll. Into the ten foot of the step up. Nice easy hop in. Rally back the troops, baby. Yes. 137.81. 17 seconds different right there. That's crazy. Team go fast, man. They were messing around. Came in with the love and the Action. Dude, you're winded right oh, now. Oh, yes. What so, happened when you jumped off the course before? Chris took uh, forever in the phone base. Sleeping yeah. Sauce my footing. Not the whole thing. 7.20 by Ben. Uh, front flip by the big boy. Almost went outside the skate park. Literally almost plowed through the wall. That was impressive as well. I guarantee you so many points on the comments. He's right with a Sharpie. And you know what? We are right with a Sharpie. Are, yeah. You want to know why? Because we make big bucks. We're going to buy a whole new whiteboard tomorrow. <laughs> All right, so we're on to our last team right now. Brooks, that we got Dom Simoncini, and we got BK. They're up there. I don't know who's going to be doing which tricks, but I got a feeling Dom is not going to be doing a front flip. That's just me. I mean, is that, is that okay for me to assume that? I will accept anything you say. All right. So we'll see on this one. Vin, you're going to be the time guy. As soon as I say go, time starts. As soon as they cross the plane, time stops. Dom, you're going first? BK's going first. All right. Ready, set, go! BK dropping in. I don't think we're getting the class. Oh, oh, oh my God! Oh, oh, oh. Bump whip, beautiful. Form was good. He's landed directly in the middle of the phone pit. Oh, good bike down. This is where, this is where the boys become the men, and sometimes the men stay boys. Now can BK do some serious hop and parkour skill? Bike's been thrown through. Got to get on the rig. Now he's got to drop in ten foot. BK's in the ten. <laughs> what are we getting? Check it out. Chill for BK. All right, he's gonna pick up time right now. Perfect. Back on the seat. He's in the thing. Perfect. Right. Now, drop back. Don't trip me. Yes, he's getting this one. Going up. 
up thing. And I got 720. 720. Done! Wow. She's deep. Dom is deep in there right now. Sorry for the shakiness, guys. I'm still recovering from my last uh, my last lap. Come on, Dom, you got this. Come on, you got it. Pull that big old heavy. He's caught up on something. This, uh, this run has become from athletic to not so athletic. I think his jeans are a little too tight or something. Can you get in the 10 foot? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, well, oh, one foot drop. Oh, this is saying we gotta teach John how to drop in 10 foot. Ooh, we're gonna go put it on the board to show the boys. Very impressed with today. All three teams, perfect. Nobody messed up at all. Grind checked, 720 checked. Front flip check. Now the moment of truth, guys. John played Minecraft. I'm gonna put this, shit. I'm gonna play it backwards right here. We're gonna do one. We're going to do 06. We're gonna do a three. Now there's one more number that needs to be put on there. Whether you guys lost big or you guys won big, okay? Athlete can't lose that bad. <laughs> and we're gonna find out if Athlete could lose that bad. Yeah, and the missing number is a four! Yeah! So that means that team go fast. They lived up to this. Congratulations on winning the first ever trick relay race. That was cool, man. I'm really glad we came up with that one. It was a lot of fun. You know what? But huge shout out to the MVP, my man Chris Hall. Dude, <laughs> so good having you today, man. You reflected, baby. That took six was great, by the way. That was really nice. Can we get another one real quick? Yeah, we get one. We need to get one properly on film. We got to get up in there and film another one. What's that one with the superhero? Yeah! Wow. That was really good. I hope you guys enjoyed this relay race. We had so much fun doing it. We're definitely going to do something like this again. We're going to change up the tricks and come up with a different course too. So that's going to be it, guys. Until next time, remember to subscribe to the channel and thanks for watching. Peace.